One of the biggest myths when it comes to selling is that you need to be a great closer to close the sale. Well, the challenge with this is that when speaking with salespeople, a lot of times they associate closing the sale with, with using manipulation, force, pressure, or some type of cohesion in order to get that client to buy from you. Well, what if we looked at this from a different perspective? You never have to close another sale again. Why do I say that? Here's why. The greatest salespeople I know are not strong closers. They're great openers. In other words, they open up a dialogue to create a new possibility in order to move that sales process forward. What I'm really referring to here is permission-based closing. What if you actually got permission from the prospect to close the sale? In order to get permission to close a sale, I'm suggesting three steps that will allow you to do this effortlessly without ever having to apply pressure on a prospect. Step one. Isolate the objection. Now, let's say you're dealing with a prospect that's saying they don't have any money. Let's make sure you're not dealing with a smokescreen and you've isolated that objection down to its very core. In other words, the one thing that's holding them back from buying from you. Here's one question that will allow you to do so. Mr. Prospect, if I'm hearing you right, it really comes down to not having the budget that you've allocated in order to make this purchase. Is that accurate? Step two, gain permission to have a dialogue. Here's what that could sound like. So, Mr. Prospect, if in fact you did have that budget allocated, we would then be able to discuss the next steps of moving this process forward. Is that accurate? What if I can share with you some ways that will allow you to make this incredibly affordable while honoring the limited budget you have? Would you be open to discussing that in more detail? Step three, offer the solution. Now's the opportunity for you to offer that next possibility or solution that you didn't discuss yet or that you haven't seen that you've now created as a result of your dialogue with that prospect. Using these three steps will allow you to close in on every prospect, get that objection out of the way, and open up that dialogue, which is going to move you closer to more sales. 